Look how big he is, guys. Oh, yeah. Look at that. <laughs> big tattoo there. Man, just massive fish. Look. <laughs> that is absolutely insane. What's going on everybody and welcome back. In this week's video, we are going to take the fish that I rescued about three weeks ago to the Ohio Fish Rescue. We're taking fish that were going to be killed. I saved them. I set up a 600 gallon pool pond in my kitchen. Pretty crazy, right? Long story short is I want to take you up to the Ohio Fish Rescue and show them where their forever home is going to be. If you've never seen this place, it's absolutely amazing. I'll leave a link to their YouTube channel and donations as well because the Ohio Fish Rescue is a 501c3, which is a nonprofit organization where they ran off donations. So if you guys would really like to help this awesome place out, I'm going to leave you three links that you can donate to to help them out because they do a lot of wonderful things in the fish keeping hobby. Now it's time to get these fish packed up and get our way up to the Ohio Fish Rescue. I can't wait. Well, I'll tell you what, I am going to miss these fish. They have some big personalities, especially the Oscars. They're really fun to have. One thing I will be glad of is that I will have my kitchen back. <laughs> My kitchen's been uh, taken up by this big 600 gallon pool for about the last three weeks. I will be excited to get the fish up to the Ohio Fish Rescue. I'll have you guys come with me. It'll be a lot of fun. We'll go up and visit Brutus too. So definitely stick around for this video so you can see one of my old fish and see how he's doing. There's one Oscar. And there's the second Oscar for this container. Their air stone in and on. Get the lid on. They are good to go. Now we got the two Oscars done. Those were pretty easy, but now we got the two big fish. They have a two and a half foot red tail catfish and close to a two foot iridescent shark. Pretty crazy. Got my huge net here. This is massive. Let's go ahead and get the container filled up and go ahead and get these fish rocking so we can get up to the higher fish rescue. Now, what I'm going to do to save time is I'm just going to turn my filter over to here. And that's how we fill up the big container quick around here. <laughs> All right, here we go. Oh, yeah. Got the big two foot iridescent shark. Get in there, buddy. Here you go. Wow. Wasn't too bad. Look how big he is, guys. He's barking at me. Can you hear that? Making a lot of noise. We got the iridescent shark and the big red tail catfish in this container. Look how big they are, man. Now the other challenge that I have is that this container, it's a little over halfway full. It's very heavy. I'm a one man wrecking crew. I gotta do all this by myself. I am dreading carrying this. This is a massive container and I already have kind of a bad back. So we'll see what happens. We got the two Oscars in here doing good as well. well. Let's go ahead and get them loaded up into the car. Ah! Oh my gosh, guys. That was super heavy. It's sad seeing this pool empty, but as you guys already know, this 600 gallon pond is in my kitchen. It's time to get this thing out of here so I can have my kitchen back. We are running on time. 
It is 4.33 in the morning right now, so it's super early. But we got the two Oscars here that are doing well. And then we got the red tail catfish and the iridescent shark back here in the back in this big black container. And let me tell you, that container is very heavy. My back is still killing me. Now we're going to begin our travels to the Ohio Fish Rescue. This is located in Strongsville, Ohio. It's going to take us roughly three and a half hours nonstop to get up there. So let's go ahead and get this road trip started. All right, so we are about the halfway point, and I always like to do a wellness check on the fish, make sure they're doing all right. So as you can tell, the iridescent shark and the red tail catfish are doing just fine. Bubblers working, and I also like to test the water. Water feels good too, so they are doing A-OK. -okay. The Oscars are doing great. One thing that I like about these clear containers is I don't have to pop the lid and check on the health of the fish. You can see them right through the container here. Bubble's working, everything's awesome. Hopefully this rain goes away and the clouds clear up because not only am I giving these fish to the Ohio Fish Rescue, but we're gonna help Greg the Pond Guy build a huge koi pond in the front of their yard. So I'm gonna take you guys along with me on the next video. So stay tuned for that. Well, let's go ahead and get these fish up there. We get to go see Brutus too. I can't wait to show you him. We've made it to the Ohio Fish Rescue. Fish are doing fantastic. We are in the Ohio Fish Rescue. Look how big that tank is. Oh my God. I think it's like 14 foot long and six foot wide. Crazy. But let's look at the fish. The Oscars are doing good. And the red tail and iridescent shark we're doing awesome as well. All right guys, so we're getting both the fish in the containers here acclimated to this tank and we'll be throwing the fish into the aquarium here shortly. We just got done acclimating. Tracy's going to take over from here. And these Oscars are big and they are strong. There goes the first one. Look at that, yeah. Man, look at them go. I know they always want to fight you in the net. <laughs> it's like, just grab the other end. But look at that, under the light. Very colorful. It's a big net for this guy. But isn't this awesome seeing these fish go to the forever home? There we go. There he is, look how big he is. Now you guys can see his true size when he's in an aquarium and not a pond. And the other big red-tailed catfish is coming up to see what the heck's going on. <laughs> Little skittish. There's the iridescent shark there, looking good. So do you remember Brutus, my arapaima, that was two and a half foot big that I brought to the Ohio Fish Rescue about three weeks ago? Well, check this out, look how big he's gotten. Look at that, guys, look how big he is. I cannot believe the size of this fish. He's easily grown another eight, nine inches since we brought him here three weeks ago. So he's doing really good. But let's go ahead and feed him. Look at that. <laughs> and smack in the water. He's gotten so big. Wow. Let's see if he'll let me pet him. Yeah, look at that. Let me pet him. I cannot believe that's Brutus. That is insane how big he has grown. Unbelievable. He's going to be in the pool pond before we know it, in the big 60,000 gallon pond. Man. Such a beast. I just wanted to give you guys an update on how he's doing. He's doing great, growing quick. What's up, buddy? Well, it's time to say goodbye to the rescued fish. I'm super glad that they got an awesome home. The iridescent shark is so cool to look at him. Awesome stuff. But I had a ton of fun bringing you guys along for the ride to bring these rescued fish up here to their forever home. I have no doubt in my mind that Big Rich and the Ohio Fish Rescue will take great care of these fish. But just look at this place. 
massive. This is like heaven for me. I love coming down here. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe and ding the notification bell down below. That way there you don't miss out on any more of my content coming out. I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.